Ada for cutting off a friend for sending a weird text. So I had a friend who was speaking about taking her life for two weeks straight. I was with her most of those two weeks and trying to convince her to not do anything to herself because it's not worth it. The day I went back home, she seemed okay. But the day after I left her house, I got a text in a group chat saying she passed away. Of course, I start freaking out and crying and so did my mom because she had just met her. Well, that friend sent a video three minutes later saying, y'all thought I was unalive? Y'all weren't gonna call me to check on me that's crazy. Just wanted to tell you guys the old me is dead now and I changed my hair. Y'all didn't let me know y'all got home so I unalive from neglect, mind you. She was smiling throughout that whole video. I was very upset and angry and so was my mom because of how badly that affected me. I called that friend and went off on her for doing that because that's not something to joke about. She kept apologizing and sending paragraphs after I told her to leave me alone numerous times. She kept saying she didn't mean to make us think she was unalive, and she sent the video to clarify that, but even in the video it made it seem like that's what she was looking for even if it was for a minute. I told her I needed space, and she left me alone. Then last night she told me to look outside my door which scared me and made me mad because she wasn't respecting my space. She sent food for me and my dogs to my house which kinda creeped me out because she has my location but I never gave her my address for anything and she was only at my house one time. It was like an invasion of privacy. And she wanted to send flowers to my mom which creeped me and my mom out because my mom just met her and didn't even know her like that. So I called her to tell her to give me space but she didn't agree and kept saying that I'm not understanding her and she doesn't get why I don't understand her side of things. After a whole back and forth, she finally said she was going to leave me alone. But this morning I stopped sharing my location because I don't want her sending anything or popping up at my house. She had an issue with me on sharing it and I told her that it's best if we weren't friends right now and if we don't share locations. She started blowing up my phone with texts and audio messages saying I'm throwing away the friendship, saying I'm unfair because I'm doing all of this over miscommunication. And she keeps putting this on the fact that I'm emotional because of my dad's unalive a few years ago, but it's not even just that like, why would you joke about unalive and keep bothering me? I just want to hear other thoughts on this situation.